Hello and welcome everyone to the Titanic Honor and Glory. Yeah, that's the game that's being developed for a while. It's the it's the demo version 1.2. It's free to download, so you can find the link in the description. But what about this game? This game is being developed by few people, and they are putting really big, big work hard work and uh, they are trying to reconstruct the history, the sinking of the Titanic they are really working hard on the every texture, graphics, so it's taking so long it's been raised on the Kickstarter's fire same member let's take a look at the info demo controls um, okay, about the project I can pause and read all of that stuff but I'm not going to read this for now there's the website, you'll find it in the description. Their Facebook page, YouTube channel, they're posting some YouTube videos, commenting on their current work progress and stuff. So, today we're going to preview the, the alpha, the demo version of this game. And, uh, disclaimer, okay, nothing more interesting. Settings, you can see I'm playing on Ultra. The game is running on Unreal Engine 4, I think that it's for, yeah, and that's why the game looks brilliant, it looks amazing. Even if someone is not a big fan of Titanic story, the movie Titanic, uh, the music from Titanic and stuff like that, like me, I'm not a big fan of that and sometimes I'm really, I'm really angry when I see this everywhere, people crying watching this movie and stuff. But when I first time saw this game, I knew it's going to be something interesting. And the other fact is that there will be a nice gameplay, what I hope. You will be able to change the history to prevent Titanic from sinking. Let's start the game. You will be able to prevent it from sinking to, to talk with other crew members to talk with the passengers. You'll be able also to just watch and enjoy the drama, the whole thing and stuff. Okay. Welcome to the demo tower. Press Shift E to hide info boxes. Press E to show info boxes. Press T to enter B and W mode. Press Shift T to exit. I don't know what kind of mode is it, to be honest. If you enjoyed this demo, please support us on Indiegogo to help us complete the ship and the game. Okay, Indiegogo. Oh, maybe they fundraised the game on Indiegogo, not Kickstarter. These both are quite popular sites. Okay, so I think I need to press Shift E. Okay. And here we are. Uh, yeah, I can see quite many changes from the last time I was previewing this demo, this game. And, well, just look at it. Every single detail of textures, stuff. This looks just beautiful. You know, you can just enjoy the game just from, from these textures. The music. I'm not sure if the game is not too, too quiet, because... I'm experiencing sometimes problems that the game is too loud and you can't hear me so I'm just to be safe and making the game uh, more quiet than loud okay so for now you can't interact with any passengers there are no passengers and no real time you can just walk on the on the ship and you know Take a look how everything looks. Because it looks really amazing. That's that's one of the biggest pros of this project. Trying to reconstruct everything as well as possible. They're working with with historians, with uh, uh, with you know with everyone that's that, that will help them reconstruct this and make as realistic as possible. Okay. So, we can just walk by. 
watch photographs, photos, you know, uh, furniture, instruments, plants. Uh, we can watch the sea. Okay, is it moving or not? I think it's not moving for now. But I'm sure it will. Oh, we can sprint. I forgot already. Oh, um, I think we started right here. Can we go over there? We can't go there yet. But that's the... That's going to be the ele elevator. Not working so far. Elevator is not working in this game. Okay, I think we are going <laughs> the same place all the time. Okay, let's go to the lower deck. The music is really enjoyable. Not too aggressive, not, you know, too boring, making us sleepy. Just, you know, keeping the tension and making you enjoy the game. Okay, we can't enter any of these. We can't open any, uh, any commodes, nothing, any boxes. But still, there's much more places we can go to uh, since last time I I tried this demo, and the last time I launched this demo was like, let's say I'm not sure, but maybe three or six months ago but I, s I can see, I can notice the big difference, big progress so they are not you know, uh, in the same place, they are all the time going farther and farther hmm, I remember this room yeah, I was there already please donate to our campaign, yeah that's a nice message from the developers Easter egg. Okay. And where else we can go here? You can hear nice sounds of the ambient sounds of the, you know, uh, nearby areas, rooms and stuff. Okay, so nothing here more, nothing more. On the E deck. Oh, I wasn't here. Let's take a look at this one. You know, just look at these effects. I'm loving them. We can't go any farther, okay. Let's go the different way. Hmm. Nothing there. Okay, okay. Just looking at the details. Oh god, they are so lovely. I wish. In all games, in all games, this could look like that. You know, most of the game developers are not putting that much work into the uh, textures and graphics. But that's quite an important thing. Not the most important thing in enjoying the game and stuff. But it really makes you uh, enjoy game much more than usual. Okay, that's the uh, restaurant, maybe. It's hard to say for me all the, all the uh, rooms and names on the ship, especially in English, even if I don't know, even if I don't know them well in Polish. Holland, America, Rotterdam, New York. So many details. So many information and all of that. Um, I wish, I, I guess, is uh, very, very realistic and based on the history. Because I was, you know, watching. Oh, what, what was that? Oh, we can go here. Okay, that's where we we came from. We can try to go we I think I was here wasn't I yeah that's the place we've been to okay so we need to go higher 
Let's go higher. That's the place we started. And we can go even higher. Yeah, that's right. These images. Oh, wow. Oh, we can't go there. And we, of course, can't go there. So, I think that's for now what was added to the uh, to the demo version. Of course, they are trying to upgrade it, update, keep it uh, up to time. But and recent changes. But of course. It's more important to focus on the work, on the progressing the game. So, for now, that's all. And if you're interested in that kind of game, in, or maybe you want to uh, something I can look at, textures in this game, take a look at it. I'm not the resolu I'm not sure what's the resolution of the textures, but I'm sure it's high. Maybe 4K, maybe just full HD. Who knows? Maybe the game developers will tell us, or maybe they did already. Oh, I okay, I was there. So guys, check out the description, give a like, go check the developers page, and if you are interested, download the demo version. You can also support the developers. And disclaimer at the end, they didn't pay me anything to make this video. I just wanted to share with you something that I find interesting. Yeah, that's not an advertisement, just a preview. My overall rating for now, it's hard to rate the demo version of a game not finished, but if the gameplay, if the story, if the possible factors you can change in the game will be really great as well, then I will rate this game really high because for now the textures, the quality, the graphics gets 10 out of 10 from me. So thanks for watching and follow my channel, subscribe, like, comment. See ya!